Uh, it is great to be here today and to see three levels of government uh, working together for this wonderful project going forward. These are the type of projects that we need this co-funding delivered for our state uh, and particularly up here in this regional part of Queensland, Toowoomba. This project is a special project for this community. It's been a long time coming. This project will see two major projects done in one, one package. One here behind us in East Creek, which will see more culverts go under the road, which lets more water get away. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, that event in 2011 shocked uh, not only the Toowoomba, but it shocked the nation. It probably shocked part of the world. Uh, to see a community 700 metres above sea level experiencing what we experienced here was almost unbelievable. This has been, of this council, a priority and, and it's been continuously, that message has continued to take, whether it be to state, whether it be to, to federal and even to this community. So to be here today and to see the federal government, to see the state government, local government working together to achieve this project for something that is absolutely critical for this city and for this region is something really special. These projects involve obviously these culvert upgrades here on East Creek and West Creek uh, on the other side of town on James Street. Uh, this is the last piece of the jigsaw puzzle in the flood mitigation strategy for the whole of the city of Toowoomba following those uh, dramatic events back in 2011. More than $13.5 million commitment by the Federal Government on an 80-20 split with the Queensland Government. It's a project of about $16.9 million, a project which is, you could say, long overdue.